Look at this one. Synchrotron radiation considerations in the dense plasma focus, DPF, magnetoplasma dynamic thruster for the Air Force Research Labs. Right there, literally referencing the dense plasma focus, which is the precursor, if not the exact technology we're seeing in the orbs in the MH370 base. It's a dense plasma fusion reactor. And then look at the very next paper. The very next paper is force-free time harmonic plasmoids. And I don't even have to read the citation because I know Jack Nachamkin of the Air Force Research Labs wrote that scientific paper too because I reviewed it like a year ago. And the force-free time harmonic plasmoids was basically trying to figure out how to mess around with your electric and magnetic fields and make them parallel so that you get this weird force-free vector analysis thing going on in your plasma. Basically, how to make a stabilized plasmoid. In this Edward Teller paper, he's referencing space propulsion by fusion and magnetic dipole. That right there is the first, maybe not the first, one of the first re field reverse configuration scientific papers that we could find. And it's by Edward Teller of the Manhattan Project. Edward Teller, the father of the hydrogen bomb.